Jürgen, I don't think I've ever had an experience where two players were checking the score at the end of the game, but Adam Lallana and James Milner were just checking to see it was 5-4. That's how crazy the day was. Yeah, unbelievable game. Um, unbelievable game. And, um, yeah, you should always think it's possible. Um, and um, that, that's not easy today. I think we had a lot of problems in the game in the start. It was not... Yeah, it was. I don't know what it was. It was not enough, and um, it was a little bit football against the team who was a little bit searching for confidence. And so, but then we came in the game, and then we we played football, and we, we saw what's possible, and we made the one nil. We should have made. We should have scored the second goal. Didn't do this. <laughs> Self-fulfilling prophecy. Um, set play, set play, set play, set play, and the game changed a little bit. Opponent got more confident. Mm. Yeah, second half, we came back in the game with beautiful goals, really not only forced, good play, good football play, and uh, at the end, yeah, when I saw five minutes overtime, I thought, I, I couldn't understand why. I was going to ask you about that, because you looked like you were querying it when they equalised, and there, but you didn't query it when Lallana scored. Yeah, of course. Um, look, you're sort of saying, very funny, in my situation, in my situation I, I think why, um, in a game when we were 3-1 in behind, and it's at the end, five minutes overtime, I don't understand why it's, it cannot be because of it. So if, for example, if um, our opponent should have done um, time play, and at the end it's plus time because they made time play, I don't understand this. So that's my understanding. And I asked for this, and it was not too um, um, positive, <laughs> I would say. Okay. okay, then these two goals, and, um, and then we... Now we, I think we are deserved winner in a spectacular game, um, and but of course everything could happen today, um, and um, yeah, now we took it four games, four goals after set plays. I think it's a new record. You have to make a new list in, in, in British football. It's crazy what we are doing there. Uh, we have to, we have to solve this problem really because I think it's not always possible to make five goals. So set, uh, talking about the timekeeping, you believe justice was done in the end because you got that goal. Pun? You believe justice was done in the end because you got that goal in, in oh, extra time? I, I don't want to make too big headlines. Um, so um, it's we won. That's of course we are lucky. But what, what should I say? And of course we are not too lucky or happy when um, uh, when they made the draw in the overtime. So that's all. Uh, there were a lot of situations where we um, where we could have got a free kick, and it was a little bit of the, we had the, our feeling was. Um, it's not always 50-50, <laughs> so that's the situation. It's very emotional. So you sit outside, you enjoy the game. We are in the middle of the chaos, and we have to react. Sometimes we know what we are doing. Sometimes we don't know what we are doing. That's all. And how I said, if you want to do something with um, the things we did on the sideline, do it. But I think the game is enough story. You can enough talk about the game. There was plenty of chaos. So take the positives then. You're, you're up to seventh now. You're closing in on that top four because you, you, you couldn't let that gap open up. Now, today we want to, with all what we have, we wanted to win. But, but it's, that it would be difficult we knew about. So when you, you see um, that it's not a, a normal Premier League team in this region of the table. So because they play football, it's not only long balls and, and, and deep defending. So it's a, it's a good team with the new players, with Naismith, how we said. It's, it's really good. Fullback's really good. And, and that's, that's all um, what we knew about. But in the game, we felt, OK, we can make them problems, but then we don't, should not always you know, concede goals after set play sets because it, it's easy to play against us. You, you don't have to create chances. You only have to throw the ball over the line and then you get a set play and you bring your whole team in our box and something will happen. If they don't do it, we will do it. So that's, of course, after the game, it feels funny, but it's, uh, it's, it's really rubbish what we are doing. And um, so we have to solve this. I know mean, oh, there's a day. There's a day where we, we have a lot of um, formations. We did everything, but it's about how you behave in the, in the, in the situation. Can you solve it by going shopping? I mean, does a transfer market offer an opportunity? You've been linked with players like Tejera, but can you buy this kind of and solve this problem? Yeah, I saw on the line uh, set plays. There are 20 players um, on the market, and I think we give we take all the money <laughs> we have and buy the set play player specialists and bring them only on the pitch. No, we cannot solve this on the transfer market. That's German sarcasm, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm not sure. Maybe it's worldwide sarcasm. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome.